Let's read about Higgs, huh? Data. Ooh. Oh. Look, there's Gundams. Do you like Gundams? I like Gundams. And it's like, uh. Uh. I need the one about the son of a gun. Where is it? Higgs particles. That's it. Uh. Hartman near Mountain Knot City. Higgs. Higgs Monahan? Why, yes, I know the name. The former leader of a private courier organization, as I recall, which serviced a large region in the West and was instrumental in providing continued support to the people living there. But as we were so far apart, Bridges struggled to maintain any measure of influence over their operations. It probably didn't help that the separatist movement has always enjoyed strong support in that territory. In the wake of growing violence uh, by the demons, interesting, we were, weren't the, no, they were the skulls in MGS5, not the demons. Uh, we were shocked to learn that Higgs himself was at their head. What to make of this strange development? Why on earth would a man who once commanded a group of devoted, uh, a group demoted, devoted to American Reconstructionism suddenly pledge himself to the cause of American destruction? His name only compounds the insult. Have you heard of the Higgs particle? also known as the God Particle. It is associated with the Higgs field, that which gives all of the particles their mass. Without it, atoms would fly apart, and matter would not exist as we know it. In other words, its very presence prevents mindless destruction. Cosmic irony indeed. Look, it's tips. Look at the tips. So crazy. Look at all these tips. <sighs> uh-huh. Yeah. Oh, very interesting. So cool. Interesting. Uh, supply request. Submit one if you're in need of anything in particular. Hmm. So you can make fetch, fetch quests for other people. Bridge links. A bridge link is another way of describing the connection between you and another porter. If you want to forge a powerful bond, Consider a strand contract. Interesting. I've interacted with these people. Wow, you can get all the way to purple. It's a good thing there are no spoilers in these. Interesting. Music player. I like the figures. They're pretty cool. Ooh, do I have a new one? I've got the beginning of the game. I've got me fighting the main boss and a big and then why is there a BT just all by itself over there? Hmm. Huh. It's for how many times I've died? Interesting. No, I don't think so. I think I've only died twice. Interesting. That seems like a mechanic. You know? Seems like something is uh, going on there and I don't quite understand what. You know what will be good? More efficient storage for my stuff. 
That would be cool. Alrighty. Prototype bot delivery system, distribution Sam, center, a lot of road reconstruction. By name. Now, while there are orders we need you to accept, which are critical to the expansion of the chiral network, there are others that you can take or leave at your discretion. It goes without saying, though, that it's in everyone's best interest for you to do as much as you can. And more work means more rewards. Sure. Sam, even a porter with your skills will struggle to traverse some terrain. Fortunately, the first expedition team left behind a number of auto pavers. Mm -hmm. Supply them with the requisite materials and they'll lay down new roads. Perfect for use with bikes and other vehicles. Ooh. Don't take my word for it. Track down the one near Lake Knot City and see for yourself. Ooh. I'll mark the location on your map. That's cool. Even give you some materials to feed the beast. In case you're tempted to use them for something else, I'd ask you to bear in mind that our resources are limited. And that more road would be a godsend to everyone. Porters, preppers, you name it. Mm -hmm. You could make a lot of people very happy. I think I'm going to grab this one. And I'm going to grab this one. Yeah. And then we can accept these orders. We've prepped a prototype bot for transport. Now you'll need to take it to the distro center south of Lake Knot City. If these autonomous delivery bots prove reliable, they could revolutionize our supplies distribution network. A lot's riding on this, so be careful out there. I will be. I'll make a PP. I'll make a PCC. I should be good on all that. Should be good on all that. And I already have a reverse strike, so we should be good. Let's go. Uh-huh. I would I would love to use that vehicle. Make sure you carry pizzas properly at all times. If you do something stupid, like turn it on its side, you'll ruin it. So, how am I supposed to carry it? I'm confused on that one. No, I want to put it on the vehicle. How do I put it on the vehicle? Oh my god, does it not have cargo? Well, this is this is crazy. I gotta go back. I gotta make another one. Because that doesn't seem to have cargo. Uh, right. An improved version, two large battery units, reduces the trike's cargo capacity, but increases its range. Yeah, we should be good. Yes. Yes. No, I want to. I want to select the vehicle. The vehicle is there.
There. As long as the pizza's flat, we'll be fine. Yes, I am delivering pizza. It'll be fine. <laughs> you knew it was gonna happen sometime. Delivering pizzas. Order of time. Delivery parameters updated. Time limit set. What? Confusion. Okay, this is stupid. Why is it not letting me load cargo on this thing? You know what? We'll load up the truck. Gotta stretch my legs. Let's do this. Right on. I always, I always forget. I'm like, it's clear, we could just go, but no. Actually, we got, we got plenty of time. It's not gonna take us 30 minutes to get there. So I'm gonna put that back in the garage. bike is really maneuverable. Please put that away. That's like, hey! I like that it doesn't consume stamina because I have the exosuit. Setting forth to deliver a pizza and also drones. I know where I'm going. I just gotta be there in 30 minutes or less, right? Are the pizza's cold? What will I do if, if, if I get there and the pizza's cold and that guy's a condescending jerk to me? I really hope it isn't time fall over there. It doesn't look like it is. Alright. Then I think we'll run back and grab the bike for the distro center.
not time fall. Yay! We might grab the bike. We might not. Oh crap, it is time fall. Run, 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 stupid. Run. Why is it always raining over here? Is it just because you're a miserable human being? Is this basically your sad place, Eeyore? Alright, I can't let my delivery bots say. Oh, yeah, five minutes. We're fine. Right? We'll deliver a pizza to the weapons man. Hopefully he'll give us a better weapons. Whoa, 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 whoa. <laughs> Just when you think it's time that it's okay to scratch your neck, you start to fall over from the pizza. Why can't I make a delivery? Hello, I like to make a delivery of the pizza. A delivery of the pizza variety? Okay, apparently not. Peter Englehart. I think I went to the wrong place. Who? Ha! Ah, look at that. Stupid. Alrighty. Off we go. Well, that was fun. Hopefully we won't run into any BTs, right? That would be freaking insane if we run into BTs. All to deliver a freaking pizza. But I think this is just a rainy area. Yeah, I realize that. I probably have enough to turn back and go to that generator, though. It's probably better. Come on, get on the power group before it runs out. Come on, come on, come on, come on. Come on. Yeah, power grid. Okay, now we can... We can relax. That's all I have to do. Let's get to this generator.
There, it's full. Let's move. Time to get out of the rain. Come on. Is it still raining? No, it's not. It's not raining anymore. Awesome. Ah, crap. It's back to raining. It's only raining in a very certain area. That's kind of funny. I like that the battery indicator is around the tires. That's cool. Or I guess technically it's around the wheel. Rather than the tire. But the point is, it's Tron and it's cool. Come on. Where is he? That's him right there. Here's your stupid pizza. Delivering cargo. Delivery complete. Displaying performance evaluation. The guy didn't even answer. What? I had it in ten minutes. Yeah, long way. Because I made some mistakes. <laughs> 4,000 meters. Yeah. Yeah. Thank you for your continued support. Good work. Came all this way to bring you a pizza and you won't even talk to me. You're lame. I'm going back home and grabbing the bike. This thing's too slow. Oh, God. Did I just... I high-centered it. Okay, cool. And that's what the jump is for. For when you high center the stupid thing on a rock. Because my bike's much better than this ratty old truck. I know. We'll get there soon enough. And then we'll get it all charged back up. So in an emergency, I can pull this crap out again. But hopefully. Hopefully. I'm just going to have my bike. Because we can move a lot faster. 
Well, I'm gonna be in Lake Knot City before you can reach me. See you, losers. We're getting there, we're getting there, just hold on. See? We good. For when you're cutting it close. This thing does not have much of a battery. I think my bike had a bigger battery. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Alrighty. Now to grab the bike. But the bike does not have any cargo storage, so I'm gonna have this ridiculously large uh, package on me the whole time. But I can always rejigger it. Yeah. I'm not sure what I'm gonna come a uh, come up against though, so I want to keep my hermetic grenades on just in case. I'm not too scared of mules, to be honest. Ooh, look at my battery on this thing. That's, that's awesome. Alrighty. Now let's set up a course. I need to go here. Which means we're going to go to Craftsman first. And then, so from my current position, we're going to go around the area there. The, the mule area. Yeah, that's gonna be nice. So, we go from here, and we just politely skirt around the mules area. Without really crossing any big bad rivers. We'll just cross one here. Nice and quick. Ooh, like so. And this nice dry desert that isn't raining will be our ally. Because we'll use it to dodge the mules and dodge time fall. And we'll basically go up towards the craftsman, but not all the way. Crap. Going this way. Okay, okay, okay. Before we melt. Okay. So I can pass between the two of them here. And then, I can just hop on the interstate here. Have a nice little road to drive. Of course, it's still time fall. So it's still degrading my stuff. But, I'm gonna ride right past mule territory. On Route 23. Ha! <laughs> 
Interesting how I keep going on and off the power grid on this. This is looking real good. Getting all built up. It's awesome. actually getting off at the end of this and I'll be almost there. That was fun. A little boost. Okay. So it's going to be a hard road to hoe through here, but it should just be rocky terrain, no real issues. 